Hey everyone, everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to Five Minute Eats. All right guys, today we have an iconic British snacking item. Now, I might be wrong about that, but I feel like I've heard a lot from the Brits about the Jaffa cakes. And if I'm not mistaken, they had to have some sort of like legislation over how they classify it, whether it's a cookie or a biscuit or something like that. But regardless, it is the biscuit with fruit jelly covered with chocolate. So I feel like us in the States, we would call these a PIMS. Cause you, have you had those? It, it's basically the same freaking thing. We'll put a picture up here, but it's, it's basically this. And I like those. Now, what's interesting about this is that this is made in Serbia. Yes. Which is fascinating because a lot of this stuff is made in the former Yugoslavian countries because we recently been doing a bunch of stuff from Serbia mm -hmm. and some other former Yugoslavia countries. And it seems to be the, the, the bread basket of Europe, it seems. The snack basket of the, Europe. The snack attack of <laughs> Europe. Exactly. And guys, if you're new to our channel, basically we review everyday grocery items. So before you spend your hard-earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. You know what this is a lot like? The Krakus. Oh the yeah. The Krakus blackcurrant biscuits, because this jelly thing is quite hard to like, to break it like apart whenever you try to break the biscuit in half. But it's basically, it looks like an orange jelly and like maybe dark chocolate on top. It's soft. It smells like one of those um, Christmas time chocolate oranges. To me, it kind of reminds me of a Nella wafer with um, an orange thing, yeah, jam, yeah. and then chocolate on top. Yes, that's what it looks like too. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. Hey guys, welcome back. Our rating system. Thumbs up, we buy it again. Thumbs down, we would not. So for me, this is a huge thumbs up. This is freaking good, man. Wow, oh wow. <laughs> so what I love about this is that the vanilla wafer part at the bottom, it's very soft. And then you have the middle, which is like an orange jam. Jelly. Jelly kind, kind of thing. thing. Yeah, it's soft also. And then you have the top, which has just a thin layer of chocolate and all of them together, not too sweet, but just the right amount. It comes together really well. Thumbs up. <laughs> okay. So for me, this is going to be a thumbs up. Now... Doesn't sound like you're very passionate about it. I'm not super passionate about it because I do feel like the PIMS ones that we have here if I don't say so myself, they do seem a little bit better. However, this is good. And I could definitely see myself buying it again, especially if they had like other flavors. I would love to sample those, but this is good. And it really is like one of those chocolate oranges. And I like those, those are great. My hold up on this, I think, is the fact that the chocolate does seem like a dark chocolate and it's very rich tasting. I feel like if it had a milk chocolate, I would be like all over this. But because it's a dark chocolate, I'm like, yeah, I could buy it again. If it was milk chocolate, it'd be like, heck yeah, I could buy this again. So that's my only like hang up on it. But I like that the cookie is soft. I like that the orange, you can actually really taste that. This is good. This is a solid snacking attack. To sum it up, thumbs up, thumbs up. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use your Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.